All new here at 10 tonight, the Beaumont City Council came together to talk salaries, their own salaries. After a vote, they chose not to give themselves pay raises. Council members today take home the same amount of money they did for serving back in 1985. Now, if that proposal had passed, the mayor's salary would have been doubled from 500 a month to $1,000. And council members would have earned $900 a month instead of the 400 that they currently take home. Now, while the item didn't go through today, it did create thoughtful discussion. 12 News reporter Cameron Seibert was there for the meeting. Cam, this doesn't necessarily mean that these uh, council members of the mayor will never see a pay raise, right? Yeah, guys, that's right. There was some good back and forth at this meeting, and while it's been almost 40 years since the last pay bump, the council didn't feel comfortable making a decision tonight, but some feel like it could eventually be up to voters to decide. I would like to move that we deny. Tuesday night, Beaumont City Council turned down the opportunity to increase their own salaries. The most important qualification for any leader is not wanting to be leader. Beaumont resident Dylan Richardson told council he's against a pay raise. Uh, my take is that civil servants should be willing to do what they do for no pay at all, if minimal at most just to be re um, reimbursed for expenses and things of that nature. Council member Randy Feldshaw admitted he asked for the item to be put on the agenda to simply have the discussion. As a council member, I am willing to stand up and maybe address those issues that are hard to address. Feldshaw pointed out it's been 38 years since council members saw a bump in pay. He was also the first to deny the motion. I will be in support of, of a raise if it actually went to the voters, the people that we actually work for. City Manager Kenneth Williams says it's possible the issue could end up in the hands of voters. Council has the ability to make that decision themselves in this charter, but some councils will put that on a ballot. Salary increase for the council members, you know, that's always a difficult proposition to deal with. He adds if the council did vote to increase salaries in the future, it would go into effect the following election cycle. So the same salary from 1985 will stay put. But at least now, voters know where everyone stands. So if a pay increase was approved tonight, it would have taken effect at the upcoming May election. After it, I should say. But it is possible that it becomes an item for voters down the road. Cameron Seibert, 12 News.